In this video, I'm going to be doing a review on the Dermabug Patch product called Invisipatch. It's supposed to keep mosquitoes, noceums, yellow flies, and black flies away. And keep in mind, this is just my experience with it. So stay tuned. Tony Abreu here with Perceptive Outdoors. In this video, we're gonna be talking about mosquitoes. And right now, you know, it's it's uh, in the middle of September, 2020. It's been raining really, really hard and a lot, and there's hurricanes everywhere. And we've just been getting a lot of rain here in North Central Florida. The mosquitoes are out of control. So I set out on a mission a couple weeks ago to figure out different ways to protect myself from mosquitoes because the type of stuff that I do, a thermocell does not work because I'm always moving around. So in the process of that, I found a couple of different options. And the first one I'm gonna talk about today is called the Invisipatch. Now this company's down in uh, Coconut Creek, South Florida. And they claim that this patch right here, you put it on your arm or you put it on your body it's a little bit hard to peel off, but it's a thin layer of paper that you put on your body and it basically exerts into your bloodstream a vitamin that is, is a natural vitamin plus vitamin B and it's supposed to keep the mosquitoes off of you and their claim is that it makes you invisible to bugs, meaning like mosquitoes, noceums, black flies and yellow flies. I'm telling you right now, if this thing works like they say it does, this is gonna be huge. I know a lot of people right now that are gonna buy this and I just put one on about three minutes ago and I'm about to go to a place that I know, I was there two, two days already this week and uh, the mosquitoes, they must love my blood because they were eating the mess out of me. So I just put this on, I'll be there in like 20 minutes and at the end of, uh, I'm, I'm gonna be there for a little while actually and at the end of that I'm going to come back on and talk about this product and tell you how it worked if it worked if it didn't work and if it doesn't work I have another alternative that I'm gonna try we'll do another video on that later so stay tuned and we're gonna see how the Invisipatch works these are cheap um, and if they work like they say they do I know a pile of people that are gonna be buying them All right, so I've been testing this Invisipatch and just a real quick update. The other night, whenever I put it on, uh, it was real windy out, but I did get bit by three different mosquitoes and on my back, which is the worst, by the way. And now I am working and I'm in a spot where there's a lot of woods. And basically I'm sitting in my truck working on my phone, just doing my stuff. And there are no CMs in my truck. So I figured what a great, another great way to go ahead and uh, do another little section of this part of this review so I went ahead and got a patch uh, went ahead and got a patch out and put it on right now I'm getting bit in my head by a no -seam. Uh, I put it on about five minutes ago and uh, they're all in my truck and also a real quick note um, while I'm thinking about it here these patches if you're not careful Number one, they're really hard to get off. So if you look here, you can kind of see there's a square on top of that big square and it's got rounded edges. Well, I don't have fingernails, so it's really hard for me to get it off. But what I had to do was uh, just get it off of my fingernail. But you need to make sure, and this is a quick tip, you need to make sure when you pull that thing off that the skin you have, you know, your skin that you're exposing to put it on make sure it's exposed so that you can stick it right on your skin because I messed around and had it on my finger and went to pull my shirt up and whenever I did the patch touched itself and I couldn't get it back apart so it's got really good adhesive on it but you got to make sure that whenever you peel it off you're ready to stick it so that's just a quick tip so I ended up having to waste one because I couldn't get it off but also I stuck it right here on my arm you see it right there and Again, that was about five minutes ago. I'm gonna sit in my truck another five or so minutes and also I'll be working outside, moving around, but still I'm hopefully 
you know, I can give you a time whenever this is going to start working. So just as an experiment. So check it out. So we started out with this product and I kind of went through an intro. I've used this product a couple times now. I saw this online a little while ago and figured, hey, it's cheap enough. I'm gonna go ahead and do a review. I purchased the product and I have used this product now at least four different times. And every time that I've used it, it's basically a patch. Uh, they're about a dollar a patch. Basically, you peel it off, you put it on your arm, you put it on your stomach, wherever you want, and it absorbs this uh, vitamin stuff, thiamine and B1 into your into your body. And it's supposed to last for 36 hours, up to 36 hours. And I've used it four different times. And what it says is it's supposed to be, it's supposed to, it's supposed to make you invisible to insects including mosquitoes no seams black flies and yellow fly yellow flies each patch lasts up to 60 or 36 hours natural non-toxic environmentally safe and deep free it definitely is all that stuff but i've used it four different times now and every time i have gotten bit by mosquitoes so my review on this it doesn't work. Um, now, it, I don't know if that has to do with blood type or whatever, but here's some more uh, intel for you. Uh, basically, I'm up in North Central Florida and I go hunting at least once a week and it's generally at nighttime. And the last time we went was two nights ago. And even my buddy that went with me, I said, hey, try this patch. I'm trying to do a review on it. He put it on, same thing. Um, at one point I felt like they could have been, they could have been like landing on me and flying off, but then all of a sudden, boom, they're not landing on me. They're landing on me and they're biting the mess out of me. And the worst thing for me is the fact that a mosquito lands on me and then my skin itches from it because of the land and especially when they land on my back. So to me, this is a cool concept. Yes. And I really wanted it to work, but it didn't end up working and that's where I'm at with that. So I just wanted to make this legit. Um, it's definitely a legit review and I wanted to share that with you because I know there's a lot of people, there's not a lot of information on this right now. And there's a lot of people that I, I went to their page and read some stuff and a lot of people are, some people said it did work, but um, there's a lot of people that were wondering if it worked and I tried it myself four different times as well as on my buddy one time and it did not work the patch so and even part of the second time that I did it I was running off of a two-part patch meaning like I did it one day and then I did it again with pretty close to 36 hours just to make sure just to test it out properly and it did not work I was still getting bit by mosquitoes so that's pretty much it for my review I appreciate you watching this uh, if you like the video, please like it. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video.